Hey, everybody, Dunsparce for the win here. All right. Um, last episode, we defeated N, and we're just about to finish the game. So, yeah, we beat N, caught Reshiram and everything. Game should be over, right? Well, here's G Gichisu again, or Getsis. Uh, same, even still. Are you not of the Harmonia name, the same as I? He's just here to give us a speech and everything, right? He's not here to fight us. What a worthless son. What? From the very beginning, ends re revival of the legendary idol-seeking Pokémon in our time. It was all for the glory of MY Team Plasma. Yeah, that's not sounding too good. To manipulate the fearful populace, you did well to come back for... What are you talking about? You wanted to fight a fellow, a leaf-driven trainer who could also subdue a legendary Pokémon to see if you were a true hero. And in the end, you were beaten by a pr petty commoner for it, you utter fool! What are you talking about? That is not the way to talk to your own son! Wait, do we know that is his son? I don't know. <laughs> it seems being raised with Pokémon only made you a wretched and imperfect human in the end. Gee, I had not the slightest conception of the legendary Pokemon choosing a trainer like you, yet nothing will impede me toward my goal. Goal, I will not falter, so that I shall rule the world with an iron fist, so that I can manipulate the hearts of those humans who know but nothing. So are you saying that you're going to fight me? Because if you do, I am going to kick your ass so far up this palace place that... There won't be an ass left! <laughs> N has served as the king of King Plaza, but you know the truth of why that is, and for getting in my way, I will have to eliminate you! And of course, here comes Alder and Charon. Rule the world? Wasn't Team Plasma's goal to liberate Pokémon? Hmm. That was but a lie told to help in the construction of Team Plasma. What good would come of letting useful things like Pokémon free? But by me manipulating Pokémon, the potential of humans grows tremendously. You must acknowledge that. And so, it would be most pleasing for I to be the only one using Pokémon. You dirty, deceiving... Regardless. What? What does, regar what does regardless have to do with that? I think that was a translation error there. Now then, that which is called a god, but is ultimately only a Pokémon... NG, the one it has recognized. You have much to fear. Now have at you! I wish to see that glorious flash of despair upon your face. G! Not the way... That's just how he battles? <laughs> oh, he was healing me, okay. Try what you may, I shall not be stopped! So, yes, we have to fight Gachisu or Getsis. As many of you probably know already, um, and he by far is probably the hardest of all of the Elite Four because he has to be cheap and uses a pseudo-legendary, but that's okay because we have a legendary. <laughs> okay, Falcor, you can do this. Let's just go for a cross flame so that we can take this thing out pretty easily and or not but it's gonna go for a toxic anyways and be really gay about it and now he's got now he's probably gonna go for a protect too because by this time i know that he has protect and that's why i'm using slash because it doesn't affect him anyways but um cross flame probably isn't gonna do much let's go for a dragon ray see how much that does, um, hopefully paralyzing him? No, it's not going to paralyze him. Um, oh wow, he's gonna go for another, yeah, we're gonna switch, um, to, let's see, let's go to Eddie, since Toxic can't really affect him, or her, yeah, but hopefully, okay, full restore, why didn't I expect that, Dad? Just as everyone else does, but let's go for a Shadow Ball. Maybe that can take it out one shot, hopefully. 
No, not even close. The Toxic's gonna do nothing to us, except maybe drop our special defense. Which, that's not gonna be too good, actually. I probably should be going for a fly there, actually, thinking that way. Uh, oh crap, he's going for a Shadow Ball, too. Um, okay, that's, that's fine. Um, let's go for a full restore ourselves. I think he has another full restore. Uh, not, let's go for a fly. Or not. Crap. He's going for a shadow ball. Fuck. Well, that'll take him out. Aw, oh. oh, man. Well, there goes Desukan anyways. Um, or Kofagrigus as it's called. In oh, wow. You just barely survived that, Eddie. Um, he's gonna send out his Cure Kizan now. Which, if I remember for correctly, that's Bisharp, so we're just gonna go for Rex for jump kicking purposes, because it's just gonna die so easily against that. Um, yeah. You know what? Actually, I'm taking this chance to full restore Eddie. Because we need to get some full restore action on these two. Um, the freaking poison. Oh crap, X Scissor. I forgot about that. Uh just don't miss Rex. Okay, nice. You that should take it out real easy. Yeah, because Kirakizan can't take it. Can't take those attacks at all. Um, let's switch out on his Sazandra because he can't really do much to one, and one's got X Scissor to get some some super effective hits off of him. This is Andra actually should be pretty easy for us since we've got a lot of attacks that'll do a decent amount of damage to it. Oh, Dragon Pulse is quite hero. A decent amount actually. Uh, okay, it does about half, but we're just gonna go for an X Scissor and do absolutely nothing. That's so oh, crap. Oh, oh, oh. Um. Uh, this is... I'm stuck between her. I'm just gonna have to... Let's just go for a full score on Falcor. And we're gonna have to sacrifice one. Sorry, buddy. Or... Yeah. Sorry, one. Gotta sacrifice, yeah. And just go into Falcor, get some... Hopefully get a Dragon Breath off before... Before any... Oh crap, Dragon Breath is gonna probably take us out. Or no, we've actually got pretty good special defense. Yeah, there we go. And hopefully Dragon Breath paralyzes... Oh, crap. Um... Uh, now I'm stuck in a rock in a hard place. Um... Dragon pulsing until I'm dead. Um, I need, I need death fodder. Rex is pretty low. Sorry, Rex. Um, hopefully, oh crap, he went for a focus blast. That's gonna take us out, anyways. Ooh, Jane can get some ice beams off. Hopefully, just hopefully he doesn't get a fire blast or a focus blast off. Ice beam. Oh crap! He got a fire blast off. Crap. Um, that's gonna kill us. Damn it! Maybe this Cassandra is pretty tough. Um, let's put in Bob. to killing it. Yeah, hyper potion. Gonna go for a sword. That's gonna take us out. Maybe not. We might not get taken out. Um, let's go for a blood bomb. Hopefully. Oh, 
Told you this is the hardest battle. But I always go through a bunch of max revives in this battle. Um, let's just put out a dragon breath. Hopefully, Dragon Pulse doesn't get a crit. Doesn't get a crit. Doesn't get a crit. Oh, okay, good. That's fine. And this Cassandra goes down now. Or Hydragon uh, was its name in English. Um, yeah, we all know what it is. Hopefully, um, Bafuron. Um, I'm gonna need shit. This thing's pretty bulky too, and might cause us trouble. So let's go for a max revive on Rex to get some jump kicks. Hopefully, Afro Break is gonna do a lot. Yeah. But he's also going to hurt himself, so let's put out Eddie for Death Fall. Uh, hopefully, hopefully he can do a decent amount to himself now with Wild Bolt or Afro Break to Break works. Wow. Okay. Good job, Eddie. Let's go for a Psychic, hopefully taking, hopefully doing a decent amount to it. Okay, it didn't do anything at all. There we go. And Eddie goes down. Um, let's go to Rex. If Eddie's faster, Rex is definitely faster. This thing, well, it's not that fast overall. Um, it's basically Tauros, but- Oh, crap, that's not good. Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap. Uh, oh, wow. Alright, that works. That works. Um, now he's gonna send out his Demogoroga, which this is the seismic aid. Um, we're just gonna go for a wood horn. This is like his weak point of the group. Um, we're just gonna go for a wood horn and take it out one shot. Basic. I don't know if that crit was needed, but yeah, we got all, basically all of our HP back in. I think that's our first level 50. Good job, Rex. Um... Chibi Rudon is his. This is Electros, as it's called in English. Um, so we're gonna just keep Rexing for that um, because this thing can't do too much to us. Uh, let's just go for a stack vengeance. Hopefully, nothing. I forgot about that. Ah, uh, yeah, that's gonna kill us, damn. But he's also got Wild Bolt, so one's gonna take a lot of damage from this. But so is himself, because Wild Bolt is basically take down an electric form. Um, now. Hmm. Let's revive Bob and see if one can survive a Wild Bolt. If he can, that would be awesome, but he's not gonna. Or he is that is just excellent and he's gonna probably go for another and we're just gonna send in Bob for to absorb that blow easily and or he's gonna go for the acrobat rock but that's gonna do absolutely nothing to us and we're just gonna go for a surf let's go for a surf he's gonna go for a flamethrower also doing absolutely nothing to us and I'm not going for a Mud Bomb because he his ability is Levitate, so it's it can't be. It, oh crap, just don't get a crit. Okay, there we go. And one more Surf after this should take it out, actually. Um, but let's just go for a Lightning Potion. Just, one's got a little bit to do that, but yeah. Um... Thrower because he can't do anything to us. Maybe Dragon Claw, but nothing real big. Um, let's just go for another surf, and that should be the battle. Wow, that was actually pretty easy. I'm not gonna lie. That went over pretty well. And there's the battle, everybody. Get Sis, get Shisu, end the game. Alright, that is awesome. My scheme, my perfect scheme to dominate the world. What is this? 
I am the creator of Team Plasma, the pinnacle of mankind. Should the world not change to place me in total control? So, N, what do you think about suffering Pokemon and humans now? Whoa! I obtained the legendary Pokemon without even having to be the hero. That's all I ever needed you for, N. Look at yourself, you're a heartless, inhuman monster. Is it even worth talking with such an aberration as you? A Deku, listening to this guy's starting to just get annoying. We all know he's the heartless one here. You said it, kiddo. He's just plain hopeless. N, you must be thinking many things, but you were never really controlled by Kachisu. You weren't pursuing an ideal, just acting according to your own thoughts. Isn't that why you were able to meet the legendary Pokémon? But me? A hero? I meet no such qualifications. Is that so? Well, well now that you're with the legendary Pokémon, what will you do? That's what's important. Shakes head. Try to understand. We've been arguing over our own beliefs until now. And yet... Why? And... Even if we can't understand each other, there's no reason to reject others' ideas. Humans don't quarrel for the sole purpose to de of determining who is right. Please, think about that. And they will tow Gachisu gets this off, and we will be left to talk with N as he shakes his head and walks over to us. There's something I want to talk to you about. And listen to this kind, sweet music. Isn't it great and peaceful? <laughs> As we walk up to his throne. When I first met you back in Karakusa Town, I heard the voices of your Pokemon, and they shocked me. Why do these Pokemon, why do they claim to be fond of you? They said they wanted to be with you. Wow, that doesn't sound right. That sounds really wrong, actually. <laughs> But, I couldn't comprehend that there were Pokemon in this world who liked people. I had no knowledge of such Pokemon until that moment. And from then on, as my journey continued, my feelings swayed. Pokemon and people were all selflessly joining their hearts to help each other. So I wanted to fight you, to ascertain my belief. I wanted to face you as a fellow hero that I desired. No end! Don't jump! I considered only Pokemon. No, only those Pokemon I had known, even. I should not have opposed you, surrounded by all those Pokemon you had met. What are you doing? Don't go near that edge! Don't jump, N! It's not worth it! Well, the champion has forgiven me, but... What I do now will be up to me to decide. He's gonna throw out Zekrom? What? G! Whoa, 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 whoa! You're getting too close again, man. This may be a, this may be a sentimental moment, but too close. You must have dreams, believe in them, and walk whatever paths to fulfill them, and someday, surely, your dreams shall be realized. Well then, farewell. No! Yeah, basically, in the end. N jumps on the back of Zekrom and flies away to God knows where. We'll probably see him in later releases of other games and everything, like we do with like millions of other characters. But yeah, um, I really enjoyed this game. It's always so much fun to play it. I mean, the storyline they put into it is just awesome. I and it's actually decently tough. I've got to admit, it's a tough game for Pokemon. And I like what they did with it a lot, and I just, I don't know what to say about it. it it's a really fun game, and they did a, Game Freak did a really good job with it. I've got to admit that. It was a very good game. I enjoyed it, it immensely, and I'm glad to have shown you all it. I might do an English walkthrough of it, uh, not in, like, as many episodes as I did here, but, yeah, I might do an English walkthrough of it in the summer, I don't know, 
Um, but definitely it's a fun game, and I enjoy it immensely. I, I'll be uploading the post- I will be uploading the post game, as many of you probably saw in my comment or, or whatever with that, with, I think it was like moments. I will be uploading the post game. It might be like a week or two, but yes, I will upload it. And yeah. Um, otherwise, I had a very fun time playing this game, and I'm proud to have been able to show you all it. And yeah. So when the credits are done rolling, I'll just I'll see you all in like a week or two. All right. Um, I'll see you all then at that time. Oh, yeah, I like this part. This is all. This is pretty awesome. This just shows N flying away with Sekrom. Boom! That's awesome. But, yeah. All right, my game's gonna save, and that's all we're gonna show you. All right, everybody, see you in a week.